Well, if UTEP is going to go to a second consecutive bowl game this season, everyone will have to be on the same page, and that's in all facets of the game, down to just being in good enough shape to make the big plays with the game on the line. If you think the Miners just go out there and play, you're sorely mistaken. After today, I'm just sore. Take a look. Make no mistake, playing Division I football is very difficult. And every program has its ways of identifying the weak links. It's the roughest day of the year, probably. It's very painful. To open fall camp, UTEP tests its players' conditioning, mental toughness, and intestinal fortitude with the 300-yard shuttle test. It's simple. Five 60-yard sprints, a two-minute break, and then five more 60-yard sprints. One of our players last year that, had, that uh, had been through it at Kansas State was with us. He said, if you make this test, you will be successful in life. That's how much of a test of your integrity it is. Iowa's Hayden Fry was the originator. Bill Snyder took it to Kansas State, and Dana Dimmel has adopted it with the minors. Each position group has a different time that it has to make. Your two runs are averaged out, and then that's your final score. How hard can you go um, close to maximal effort and then recover quickly and go again just like you do when you play? Players that don't make their times have to do extra conditioning throughout fall camp, and seeing as I'll be covering the majority of preseason practices, it only felt fair that I try to pass the test myself. Now, I'm no speed demon. Coach Dimmel gave me a simple goal. Make it under 56 seconds, the same time that they give their offensive linemen. Have they told you that I'm running it? You're running it? I'm running it. I don't know. Good luck. What do you think? Like, what do you, what do you think of my odds? This is like one percent. Do you think you, you think you'll make it? Well, I have to average around 56, so I think I, I think I can do 56. I, what do you what do you think? Do you think I can do it? How often do you run? What, define you're, running. You're not, define you're running. Not, you're not gonna make it. I, I I really do wish you the best, Colin, but I don't think you're gonna make it today. I'm always up for a challenge, and with a special guest sportscaster, out of way. It was time to hit the field. <laughs> I wonder if Colin's gonna do the flop like that, Sam. His mental state right now, I think he's, um, stomach's gurgling a little bit. Scared, I think would probably be the best word. Deaver's migrating to the kickers because he wants to have the same type of chest as one of, the, one of the guys he's standing next to on film here. Yeah. That's a body right there that skips leg day. That's for damn sure. He getting ready to do the hardest run that we've ever done. And barely any of us, he gonna die. Colin Deaver steps to the platform. Poor man's version of J.J. Watt right here. Very poor man's version. And we're playing his walk-up song, The Sandman. <laughs> Look at that stride, that beautiful form as Chris turns. He's opening it up. He's got his game face on. Look at that face right there. Little less twitch in that body. Little less twitch to see his finish. The first one's gonna be the one you go hard, and the second one is where you're fighting, fighting demons, so you gotta, you gotta go. How much rest was that, Coach Shot? How much rest was that? Two minutes? I think he got longer rest. I think this is an inside deal right here. Gotta finish. He's gotta go. That's where you see, you see the refrigerator get on guys' backs sometimes. Down goes Fasia. <laughs> JJ Watt, I think you're okay, buddy. You got your DN job for another year. Went out way too fast on the first one. I got 49 seconds. The second one, legs locked up, I got 58. Which averages to a 54, which means I passed. Wow, good job, you made it! <laughs> I, you I did felt it. like that all day, the how I was in that life. That was real, by the way. We did not set that up. I was, I was dead. I mean, it is so difficult to do that. They're skilled players, like I said. They have to get a forty-two that twice in forty-five seconds yeah. or less. It's incredible that they can move that fast. There's guys like normally I would have to, if I was actually a Division One football player, I would have to get like forty-nine seconds twice mm -hmm. at, for a guy my size. As you saw. I mean, it's it's Difficult. it's it's real. So if you if you think you're good enough to play Division One football, go try that test, and that'll be a, a really good indicator whether or not you can. The so. best thing too, Dana Dimmel. It, it just seems like he enjoys this day very much. So he was. Everyone else it. doesn't like it. <laughs> Everyone else hates it. <laughs> See, 
He has never run the test. He told me he's never know, actually it, run the test. Yeah. So it's a little bit unfair. I feel like <laughs> you can't make fun of people if you've never actually done it. But he's the head coach. I'm the head coach. Why would I run? <laughs> Why would I run it? So I want to. Th yeah. Thanks for thanks for letting me come out, guys, and, and kill myself. Thanks to Sam Guzman for shooting the story too.